So what's up, I'm Bunch Back to the Take. Really quick talk about a video I want to do. Really quick, of course, got some really good stuff, got some really good news. I'm a little bit tired though, so I just kinda of wake up about a month ago. A little bit tired though, but let's get started though. Of course, because the new Dragon Ball Heroes slash Dark about collab campaign. I'm glad going on and stuff like that, of course. Um so yeah, hope the video goes up a little bit later today. Again, if you do not see it upload today, I'm gonna to upload this video. Probably soon as done with editing and stuff like that. Hopefully it shouldn't take that one to go through, but we are getting again this for both Global and JP specifically though. So yeah, again, there's no like global first or whatever. I'm um, just coming to Global as a little crossover thing at the end of November. It's good that Global and JP are doing this, so I'm so glad. Hopefully they'll do this next year at the same time, around the same time next year. It'd be really awesome to go for both games so you know have both stuff at the same time. So Goba doesn't have to wait for this and Goba doesn't have to wait for that. I think this is why a lot of people want the games caught up, but I think Goresh has a good point because you know the Goba tickets are going to be exclusively gone with all the Goba stuff we have. But maybe the people like Trump probably all be gone and stuff like that. So yeah. Doka now, um I'll probably link it below so you guys can see it for yourself. Um again I kinda of, I kinda of get one of the link the video and stuff like that. You hear a lot of like weird noises this window, like it's really windy where I am right now, so yeah. Um, go ahead and get started. We got lots of new stuff to talk about. So yeah, jumping right in. Don't want to waste too much time. Um, so yeah, for I'm um, ducking now. We got lots of new stuff. We have a new um, protect history time patrol. I guess it's like a bank, like um, it's like a new battle mode similar to Infinite Dragon Ball history. Probably like, you know, it's like probably like Dragon Ball history. Probably with a new coat of paint or whatever. That's new. That's coming to um again both Gold and JP. Um, this is completely new. Um, again, it's common. I think it's like I heard like a combination of boss rush and like Infinite Dragon Ball history. Even though that's I mean. You haven't dropped because we literally like boss rush and like literally go to event kind of order under one. That's why I can say it as. So yeah, um, again, this is similar to the Infinite Dragon Ball History event. Uh, again, this kind of simple as it is. Again, when it comes out, we'll know for info details. Also, I think it's heard. I heard they kind of slipped in like part two. This will be part two for the like, celebration for Global. I think for JP, this will be a completely new um um thing about um thing about not thing about um campaign with them because it happens every year. So yeah, again, they just survive in the year like this all the time. I, I won't be mad. I'm not mad. I love it. Yeah, get game. Yeah, get the game stuff like that like this. It'd be awesome. We're getting a new um, Super Dragon Ball Hero Dark and Kurosaga event. Um, so yeah, of course you can farm um, up this guy. I forgot the name. I think it's like Demon God Souza? 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 Not Souza. Um, I think it's like Souza? I can't remember his name. Again, I know from Dragon Ball Heroes for like a long time. Again, I know, like, I've been watching Dragon Ball Heroes since like it kind of came out. So yeah, I've kind of been following it since then. I remember, I remember when Super Saiyan 3 always came out. I was like, okay, that's kind of thing. Um, it was really just fan for service and stuff like that with the canon. I was like, yeah, okay, that makes sense. It's a, more, it's a more promotional thing. We can, um, I guess, um, it's in order to collect the Dark Dragon Balls, because, um, that is a thing in Dark Ball Heroes, like, an evil, like, Dark Dragon Ball thing. Oh, yeah, Global. That's kind of weird, because I just noticed that the Mirror and Toa Awakenings for JP. That's them right there, so it's weird Global got them. I don't know if Global get them early or not. They could push it early for Global. I had a feeling they would maybe do it, but I don't think they're going to do it, because they would have mentioned it by now in here. Or drop it as a surprise. Mirror and Toa coming back with Awakenings early for Global. They didn't before. They didn't stuff like this early. Um, Again, though, um, yeah, I should have told my fan. <laughs> but I do a video that's always super hot. So, yeah, um, yeah, we should be getting on that, um, with that character. He's gonna be free, free to a card, free to play him and stuff like that, free to play rainbow him and stuff like that. So, yeah, um, I think right here it's all the awakenings for the past. Trios units they are getting awakenings now, so again, when they come out, we'll probably see it. I, I think they are, we are here info for them. I just didn't pull it up. I just, uh, just I got so much tabs open already, so so yeah. Again, really busy right now for Doken right now, just really freaking busy and crazy. Um, right here was the uh, new Doken Fest event. So here's the buggy, the very first Doken Fest unit. It is a Super Saiyan 4 Xeno Vegeta. So yeah, you are not excited because Vegeta is my favorite fusion. Um, do you have Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta already? And, no, they do. Super Saiyan 4 Kaoken Gogeta. So yeah, I people complain about Vegeta, but you guys got something for him, right? Right? Just saying, like you guys are gonna miss out on this once time thing. So yeah, I mean, no, they, they come back every year, so yeah, again, this will probably come back next year, he'll probably be on the banner. It really made sense he was going to be a token fish unit, I feel like everybody called it, not like, oh, I called it first, everybody called it, even myself, Garage, Troop, a lot of our, um, down Bobber, even like, again, um, I would say Jinro, um, again, lots of stuff going on right now, so yeah, um, I, I mean, I had somebody else in my head, um, I was thinking Hydros, maybe, I don't know, again, I watch so many people, I watch so many YouTubers nowadays, um, yeah. Um, but yeah, though, um, like I said, though, um, our very, very, very first Doka Fest unit will be this Vegito. He's a completely new Doka Fest unit and stuff like that. So, yeah, um, again, it may be like considered as a Doka Fest banner or a crossover Doka Fest banner. I'm glad because, again, yeah, Heroes has been out for 10 years. It's made sense that we're going to have a Doka Fest unit. Again, even Goresh, like I'm saying it over and over and over again. I'm not going to disagree with him. He was right because, like, it's been 10 years. So we had to get a Doka Fest of one of these guys an hour later. Even though they all are Doka Fest worthy in the future, maybe we'll get like a Doka Fest counterpart or whatever in the future because they are all from Xenoverse. Xenoverse is his own thing in Dragon Ball Heroes. So, yeah. 
And of course, we got all oh, got five stones, of course, for the um campaign. So yeah, I got those I lost. Ooh, I'm kidding. Um, yeah, a little bit Japanese lesson from your boy Hyper the Sonic. Um, but yeah. Um, so yeah, of course we got Super Saiyan 4 Bar, again, go over all the units, break them down and stuff like that, so yeah. And he's super physical, so I'm glad they're getting the buff again. They're super physical, they didn't need it, because they already have good enough units. But it's still good though, he's physical. That's going to be the tech, because it's like his aura and background and stuff like that. Or SDR, because of the coloring and stuff like that, so yeah. The Super Saiyan 4 Bar, I think they have Xeno vs. Counterparts as well, because we, we're probably going to get him as a Doka Fist later. Like Super Saiyan 4 Xeno Bardock. And stuff like that, because again, I, again, he's so confess worthy. So yeah, they all have a new category called the crossover category. Basically, everybody in the crossovers, I will go over that like a couple after I'm done breaking down all these units. Um, it'll be every crossover unit and stuff like that for all the Dragon Ball Heroes units. Again, I had myself out when I first saw this, all this stuff. So again, I, for me, at times of I did kind of just wake up like, that's too long ago. So yeah, I'm falling all over on sleep. So um, I seem tired. I don't seem as hype as I do, but whatever. But yeah. Um, it is a new category and stuff like that, so yeah, crossover, they're all getting up having this category, leader skip anyway, it's leader skip anyway, again, all crossover characters like Arale, um, um, Dragon Ball Fusions, what did they bring back that event, because Barlock, because they're not waking on global, they never brought it back for some odd reason, because when they bring back Keith events, they had to, um, for Keith events were part of memories, if you guys do not know, um, once event, um, try to think of it, um, once a... It has to come, the event has to come back the first time, like, for example, like, you know, like any story event, like, well, the first time when it comes back, it won't be there, but it'll come back again. I think if it's previously, previously been brought back, it'll be back in there already, because it'll be technically, um, the event will be technically revamped slash renewed or whatever, but yeah. Um, hitting off on that, so yeah, super attack, immense damage, lowest, um, seals, medium, I think medium chance of selling super, and seal super attack. Um, everybody really does that. So yeah, um, so let me see, attack and defense plus, um, 140, they're all gonna have this, um, little thing right here, plus additional attack and defense plus 40%, um, when another, um, when there are four or more crossover, crossover, um, cap, category, crossover category allies, um, on the same team, attacks, let me see, effective of all types, um, if AP 80% or more becomes a crit when AP 90% or more. So basically, you want to get him at really high health for this guy. You really want to get him super, super, super high health, um, for stuff like that. Again, they all have the same type of leader skills, stuff like that, leader skill, passive, whatever. Again, pretty much all the same thing and stuff like that, so yeah. Um, on to my next character, probably my favorite one right here, um, yeah, so again, he's like Dark Fest Bar, where it's gonna be effective against all types, but not finding what to put on an enemy. And again, he's a downgraded Dark Fest version of Bardock, I wanna say, because he does crit and he does, you know, he does full additionals and he flash crits. If you find like a, um, with the blind enemy or whatever, so yeah. Um, next character, probably my favorite, so we said for a Gohan. You already know how I feel about this, so yeah, um, yeah, and there are two different versions of Super Saiyan 4 Gohan, like this Super Saiyan 4 Gohan Xeno, there's, um, Okay, I can't solve that for a second. Yeah, Super Saiyan 4 Gohan Xeno. Um, I think yeah, there's the one version of him. There's more stuff like that. Like, yeah, like him to class and stuff like that. So he just technically, I, I know when he first came up, this one's like from like GT or whatever, because you know, it's like Super Saiyan Gohan. They go, like they could do it for Doka Fest. Like have him Super Saiyan 4, then put him, um, yeah, Super Saiyan 4. The you know, Super Saiyan, like, because he's wearing like the purple key and stuff like that. Super Saiyan, Super Saiyan, like a Doka Gohan, they are transforming and stuff like that. That's good for that guy. Um, Different spots still that. So yeah, there's great power. So yeah, Skoba is getting a giant, giant eight power. How do you pronounce it? Skoba is getting that early, really, really early. That's good for them. Um, category key three, everything got 120. Um, passive does attack defense plus one four. Okay, yeah, that was the same thing. Reduces damage by 40%. Um, the four more giant, great. Yeah, basically Bardock, just um, great power getting the buff. Category allies on the turn. Um, for great power, um, I think it's the four more um, allies on the same turn. Besides, it just had a chance of stunning the attack enemy. I'm performing a super attack, so yeah. Really simple there, again, crossover characters aren't nothing like the best thing in the world, they're just crossover characters. Again, like, oh, they only got four links, because they are going to wake in the future, they do not wake in now, but they are going to wake in probably next Dragon Ball Heroes thing they come out, because for like, the board, uh, like for like Mira, so Super Mira, and like, Final Form Demigra, they need like a waiting, because they haven't got them like in years, so. But for um, GP and stuff like that, they have a little bit longer than Goku did, so. Yeah. Um, again, these crossover characters are super simple. Probably the one, one that people really wanted the most, Super Saiyan 4 Broly. When Doka Bell gets pop vinyls, you guys know what I'm talking about. Pop vinyls, when they get pop vinyls, it's going to be over for these guys. So yeah. I mean, they have clap speakers, but at the same time, they will be kind of, you know, I mean, they'll probably take the photos and stuff like that, so yeah. Um, so he does great power, key three, everything up, um, I think. I think Gohan, yeah. Yeah, again, they're all just downgraded versions of Vegito. Like, Super Attack, I think, what is Super Attack Okay, sorry about the cut right there. I had to do something really quick. So yeah, um, he does great power, key four, key three, everything up, 120, oh, 130. Oh yeah, just, they're, they're, yeah, they're dumbed down versions of Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, essentially. So yeah, a lot of people think, oh yeah, Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta can come early, they go, you know, just bring the category early and stuff like that so I can prepare for it. Not prepare for his arrival, but 
Does, again, they bring the stuff up early. It doesn't mean, oh, they're going to get confirmed early. Like, Goku family and Vegeta family. Um, those got confirmed early for Global. Look at the 8 bit Goku and Vegeta. But we didn't get, we already knew they were coming out for the 4 universe anyway. They're not going to change that to scheduling or whatever. Um, so yeah, all, same thing, tactical, blah, blah, blah. blah. Um, one from Super Attack. Oh, yeah, all Broly's trying to do that though. If he, if he attacked all, he'd be insane. Um, like, it costs over characters. They're not supposed to meant to be like, oh, the best students in the game. They're just meant to be here for crossover purposes and stuff like that. So let me see. I know he has. Has additional become a super attack. Um, has a high chance of becoming a super attack. Um, yeah, becoming a super attack if there's no great power category ally on the team. So yeah, again, you're gonna run them all together anyway, though. So yeah, you look at the list level again. Go about the link update now, so you can again. Though I got some little link sets and stuff like that. So yeah, that's really good. Oh yeah, first battle. So yeah, really just awaken from the um super Saiyan four Vegeta medal. So yeah. Um, all the other guys don't. They're gonna probably awaken next year. This is Demon God um, Salsa. I say Sal. I say Salsa. I almost say Salsa like Salsa. I, I, again, I already know about him for years, so I think he's a good guy in the end, too. So, again, like, you can get like, a good guy very different later. So, just got over category, key 3, everything up 50%. Passive does attack defense puts on 60%. I didn't read really the super attack effect. Where is attack for one turn? It causes this probably like, um, um, probably like what? Like, super damage? Okay. Um, yeah, attack defense plus 60%, plus additional 5%, um, attack plus 50%, up to 80%, up to 60%. Um, high chance of any enemy super attack, including super, high chance of any attacks, including super attacks, plus, um, plus, um, up, up, plus, um, up 10%, up to max of 30%, for cost of a category all on the team. Again, they're all going to be working together anyway, that's all, all they're going to be. Um, Demon God Dabora, so that's a new one right here. Again, I thought they'd be, like, on Realm of God and stuff like that, because, like, the God name, but, again, I already knew, yeah, like, this Dabora is not actually kind of nice for them, When I first saw it, too, I was like, okay. Um, I have a who's going to be Xeno. Again, they can't, like, like work up their names, like, they could remove the Xeno. And then stuff like that. So yeah, he does Dragon Ball Heroes key three, everything up on um, one thirty. Um, first passive does. Yeah, he has a paragraph on the passive. Attack defense plus hundred percent, plus additional attack defense plus hundred percent, and enemies attack enemies attack defense minus twenty percent for two turns. Um, when attacking one enemy, um, plus additional attack plus defense. Um, additional defense plus hundred percent, having a high chance of evading. Um, high chance of evading. Plus super attacks, um, evading attack and super attacks, um, facing one facing two or more enemies. Um, you haven't really kind of seen that a lot, so yeah, I didn't, I, I mean, I forgot about the categories, crap. So yeah, I would have the same type of categories, crossover, heroes, that's what I meant to do, I, that's why I feel so off. Yeah, because it's all gonna have, I mean, they all gonna have the same category anyway, though. Super Saiyan 4s, you know, red power, you know, typical stuff. Um, I completely forgot to go with that, that's why I did it. So yeah, and we got the new girl on the street. Um, Darkness, I, where did that even come from? Um, Demon Goddess Toa, so yeah, another good Toa in the game. And she's extreme in, so yeah. Um, she in physical, and they got a good buff for the Devora as well. Um, I got probably go over them when they come out more and more and more. So yeah, she does, I think same thing as Devora, just up 50, 150. Um, attack defense plus 100%, or LS key 3, attack defense plus 30%, high chance of additional attack defense plus 10% for our allies. Um, another high chance of it, um, yeah, another high chance of it for extreme class enemy. Yeah, another high chance of it, um, for our, our, our allies again. It really, it really repeated that twice. Was that like error, or they just meant to do that? Um, no, because they didn't end up talking out too, I think. Or it might be like an error or whatever. Stream class allies attack defense plus 50%. Um, and moves. Hello, Devin. And remove and recover is 50% um, HP. Um, what well, if he's 50% or more? Or less. But once. Okay, that's really good, though. Um, I might not read the links or categories, though. Again, they're all going to be pretty much the same thing anyway, though. So it's a uh, more half counterpart. Um, and she can stream in. That's cool, because it's a stream tech. We got the boy, the final boy right here. Super Saiyan 4, Xeno. Um,. G Vegito again, no defense worthy. I'm glad they did. It's animation. All the animations are really good. I will upload them to the channel once I get some time because again, so much stuff came up today just for Dokken specifically. It's like, holy crap. So yeah, um, yeah though. Um, I waited for this for like a really long time. You guys know I'm a big Vegito boy and Gogeta. I like them both equally. Um, but yeah, again, this, this is crossover thing. thing. So for him, yeah, super attack, yeah, crossover category, key three, everything up 170. Oh god. If he did super, no, if he did great power, yeah, there's no point in like super Saiyan full Vegeta anymore. So yeah, um, great defense, uh, great defense, um, great defense for one turn causes immense damage. Uh, let me see for his thing. Yeah, that was whatever. Because of our category allies, key one, because they all have the same lose second defense. That's why I said, <laughs> I said forget all that crap. Um, um, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm so off with that. I'm, I'm so sorry. What the heck was that? I just, I, I don't know. That was too funny. That was too good. I messed myself up there. Um. Yeah, um, cost of a category allies key one attack attack defense plus one um attack defense plus twenty percent 
Um, it's going to go for greater power. Um, it's gonna, yeah, it's going to go for greater power and a high chance of any enemies attack, including super attacks. I possibly go for four additional force guys. Super attack um, great risk defense for one turn. I suppose he already has built-in dodge anyway, and he does counter with um, it does counter. I'm glad the other ones didn't counter as well because um, yeah, because again, all they got they're both the time travelers though, so that's really good for that team. Um, I think I've mentioned put it over here. Yeah, Granite Power is a new um, category coming to Global. It gets everybody who has the power of the Granite, but essentially, I know Dragon Ball Super Brothers is on here, Super Saiyan 4 is on here. Don't confess Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. He's not coming out of the Global, they just put his category in the game early. They've done this before, again, Goku Family, Vegeta Family. They've done this way before, guys. There's nothing new, again. Um, this basically essentially is our Granite category, because all the Granites are going to be on here. Time Travel is getting another good buff right here, and Dragon Ball Heroes. Um, again, they're all getting category buffs up and stuff like that. So, yeah. When I'm talking about the crossover category, basically all these guys are here. They're all going to be in the crossover category. Basically, everybody who's been in a crossover unit, they're all going to be on here. All Dragon Ball Heroes units are going to be on here. Mira, Toa, and uh, yeah, because um, they have this universe um, tip tag, like, um, tip on um, watermark down where, they're, where they are. So, yeah, Aurora is probably going to be on here as well. Um, I don't know if they should update her, like, tag. Because uh, Aurora, like, again, she, she, she originally was supposed to come back with Inko Jide at Sierra Junipa. She never came back, which is really weird. The quick got the Dragon Fight Caesar for these guys as well. And then of course, um, the events right here for Dragon Ball Heroes, all we, uh, Super Dragon Ball Heroes events, uh, the, the World Mission events, they will not be uh, available right now. They're currently unavailable with the um, keys, the Pro Memory keys. Um, I think I'm talking about these guys right here. Um, this one and this one, they're unavailable with keys right now. So yeah, you cannot um, go in the game and get them. So yeah, that's pretty much it though. I want to go today. That's the full Dokken now and though all the new Super Saiyan 4 units. Again, they all have the same category, Time Travelers, Crossover, Dragon Ball Heroes. Again, Dragon Ball Heroes, Time Travelers, and Great Powers are all getting buffed from these guys. Again, really goodness. we got lots of new stuff up right now in the game. So yeah, not in the game right now, but again, when they come out and stuff like that. Again, for times recording right now, I think it'll be like three days later, I think. Again, I don't know what's going on. Uh, it said, I think the time's recording three days later, so it will be on the 21st. Uh, they did it last year for Comfort. They had this like timestamp. I actually meant to pull them up. That has timestamp and stuff like that from last year. So yeah. I'm going to the end of the video here. Um, I spent enough time talking about it. Lots of new stuff. Lots of new stuff. Again, it went over my just so much craziness right now. So yeah, the full info stuff like that comes out in a couple of days. I will go over it myself. Again, lots of crazy, crazy, crazy stuff going on right now. Just freaking insane. Like they were not holding back this event. Again, it has been 10 years since the release. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and off on the Dark Fest teaser right here. Again, I hope JP, because I know they had like a wallpaper for Dragon Ball Heroes. For some odd reason, Global never, JP never got that as a Global only thing. Hopefully, they'll bring that, like, new wallpapers and stuff like that. Again, the celebration for Dragon Ball Heroes is gonna be insane. It's a crossover thing, but because Global, I think it's gonna be their part two for the biggest celebration. I think it is, and JP will be a separate campaign. Again, gonna go ahead and end here, so I could talk about this all day, but I do want to save it for that video specifically when that comes out. Again, three, two days again, it'll be on 21st. Um, so yeah, see you guys later, though. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, brother. I'll quit it again, though. Um, yeah. It just, I have no words. I basically geeked out everything. So yeah, see you guys later though, again though.